What's up guys, we're back with the latest news. The world of tech was getting a little less exciting, but Samsung is back again, taking full-on jabs at Apple. They've done this to Apple many times in the past, but this time, these shots are completely valid. So Samsung has released two videos targeting the iPhone 12 Pro Max directly. The tagline that Samsung is using for this is also pretty badass. Your phone upgrade shouldn't be a downgrade. So in the first video, Samsung goes directly after the zoom setup of the iPhone 12 Pro Max. Unlike most Android phones, where you see 5x to 10x or even 3x optical zoom, the iPhone 12 Pro Max can only give up to 2.5x. And Samsung, as we know, is the best when it comes to zoom. We have a 10x hybrid optical zoom that allows you to go all the way up to 100x, which in turn allows you to take moon shots. And by comparison, the iPhone 12 Pro Max just looks super outdated. Now in the second video, Samsung has another valid shot at Apple, and this has more to do with the camera software. So not long ago, Samsung introduced this camera function called single take where you just press the button once and the phone automatically takes videos and photos based on AI and gives you all the nice moments. Basically compile all the nice moments in just one shot. And as of now, Apple has no implementation similar to single take. You can just take one photo or one video at a time. So looking at these videos, this is definitely a much better jab at Apple compared to their previous campaigns when they made fun of Apple for removing the charge and then Samsung did the same thing and later they had to delete those tweets. And same thing with those genius ad videos, they had to delete them afterwards but this shot is completely valid and I don't think Samsung will have to delete them later on. Let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. Also in the news, if you're looking to buy a flagship phone that is absolutely amazing for the money, then you should wait for the upcoming Galaxy S21 FE. We've got a brand new leak coming via Geekbench listing and it shows that the S21 FE is indeed raw the flagship Snapdragon 888 processor. As for the international markets, it will be packing the Exynos 2100. Pretty much, you should know that this phone will be on the same level as the S21 lineup. As for the other specs, we've got the 120Hz refresh rate, a great high quality display, similar camera setup as the S21 lineup, and a lot more colors. Samsung will once again bring this phone at $699 price, so it's gonna be a pretty good phone for the money once again. Now speaking of the Galaxy S21 lineup, Samsung has seen some massive revenue gains. According to the info compiled by Counterpoint, all three Galaxy S21 models are in the list for top 10 smartphones by revenue for Q1 2021. This is definitely a big win for Samsung. Again, this is by revenue. When it comes to the sales volume, obviously we don't see any Samsung flagship up there or any Android flagship phone, which is kind of sad. You just see the mid-range and budget Android phone. But still, the number of sales that Samsung was able to generate from the S21 lineup has given them a lot of boost when it comes to the revenue. And last but not the least, Samsung is working on the upcoming Galaxy Buds 2, which is going to be the successor to the Galaxy Buds. And it's not going to be as good as the Galaxy Buds Pro because it might not have the active noise cancellation. But the pricing is said to be really good. It's expected to be even cheaper than the $200 Galaxy Buds Plus, so super affordable. So that's all the latest news. Samsung is back again taking jabs at Apple and in my opinion pretty valid jabs uh, these are definitely the limitations that we see on the iPhone 12 Pro Max Apple is said to implement long range zoom setup probably by next year but this year the zoom setup will probably remain the same they might increase the zoom to 3x level on the iPhone 13 Pro Max but yeah again we'll see what happens in the news let me know your thoughts in the comment section below if you guys are new here be sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys later peace out